Food with locals, holy crap. I've been looking forward to this since we made the date because eating food with locals is very exciting. And this is only the second time we've done it, so it's very, very new. And we are hanging out with Michael. Hello. Hi. Hi. Michael, where have you brought us? So this is Mother Mash. It's just in Carnaby Street, off Oxford Circus in London, central London. Um, it's a good little traditional English place where you can get a selection of mash, selection of pies, selection of sausages. There's a selection of mash? A selection of different mash from all around, like the British continent, British Isles. Are they made of different potatoes or...? Different. Um, so the Irish have a traditional mash called, called, called Cannon, which you can try here. A bit of okay. cheesy mustard mash, um, there's classic mash, sweet potato My mind mash. is being blown on mash, yeah, mash this is right new. now. I thought there was just one mashed potato. I, I thought there was just one, one mash. <laughs> okay, all right. So lots of mash, lots of sausages lots of pies and even different types of gravy so you can try different lots of additional traditional gravies from around the British Isles so yeah good place to try food. Is here. Mother Mash something that stands out from among the rest that you've been to or like other pie restaurants? So pie and mash is a really traditional sort of British staple you get it at like a lot of the football grounds um, a lot, it's a lot of it's an old sort of street food and um, you get it a lot in the pubs in the hotels but um, this place is just this is what they focus on and it's all high made here uh, I think I believe but you know so it's you know it's fresh stuff so yeah, yeah we always quality. focus on or try to focus on places that are doing one thing that is fantastic so yeah this, so, this certainly I yeah mean, this is right up our alley perfect, yeah. <laughs> I mean London's a great city for food you get lots of different types of food but you know if you want traditional English food you know I always suggest to my friends come here first you know and try something here you know. just a background on you are you born in London like what's, so, what's yeah, your situation so, yeah, I'm, I'm, well, I'm from North London from there called Barnet um, my family are Anglo-Indian so um, this is to do with uh, colonization of India so somewhere in my family's paternity there's an um, English serviceman mm -hmm. so my, yeah my surname is very Scottish my first name is very English yeah. I, I, when you came up, I was like, wait, right, who is this? <laughs> I'm just going to be straightforward about that. Jobbing interviews go a bit that. crazy when they're looking for me, yeah, they yeah. don't expect me. Yeah. I just stopped looking, I was like, everybody yeah. here looks... Yeah. Uh, nope. Yeah, it's very, uh, yeah, very eclectic mix, so yeah. Yeah, cool. Alright, I'm ready to eat. <laughs> I, I have picked up this plate and it weighs quite a lot. I don't know if it's the plate or the pie. What did you What did you order? Do you remember what it was? So um, the way that the way that this ordering system works is you choose a mash, then you choose a pie or a, or a sausage, sausage, and then you choose a gravy. And there's quite a few of them on the menu. And um, do you remember your combination? My trifecta was a cold cannon, which is like a Irish uh, uh, traditional cabbage. thing. Yeah, yeah, I've got cabbage. Um, I have some spring onions. Yeah, some onions and your like basic butter and milk uh, with your potatoes. There's potatoes in there. And um, the pie that I chose was the traditional minced meat. And gravy is... I forgot. Farmers. Farmers so gravy. it's like a mushroom and something else. I'm not sure. Okay, and I went with a um, mustard and was it mustard cheddar and, and cheddar? And mustard, mustard and cheese. Cheesy, um, cheesy mash. mustard. Cheesy mustard. I grabbed the sausages only because everybody else grabbed pies. And I just wanted to see what the sausage game was going to be like, and I chose two different sausages. One of them is a. Um, a Smithfield 1862 is what it was called. Do you know what this is? No, we don't even know what that is. And then the other thing, the, the other sausage was, do you remember Katie? Uh, mint and, uh, no, uh, mint lamb and yeah, mint. lamb and mint, which I'm pretty surprised, uh, excited about. And then my gravy is this uh, simple um, onion-based gravy. And use is yeah, completely different so color than ours. We've got the liquor here, which is a traditional English gravy. So that the green gravy. Yeah, so liquor. that's parsley in there. Okay. The mash is a what did we go with it? Sort of cheesy. Champ. 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 That was it. Champ. Yeah. yeah. And a chicken and bacon and leek. Lovely. Oh yeah, that chicken yeah. looks good. Oh, it looks awesome. I, I'm gonna try your yeah, go uh, liquor go real quick because I I don't I don't know what to, un, to even think about. Yeah, it's a mashing up. It's literally called liquor, like liquor as in booze, but wow. Okay, so it's that a little is bit. definitely parsley. That's just <laughs> that's just parsley. Yeah, it's very very green. You're right. It's yeah, a very strong super, parsley taste. Super super green. Uh, my gravy. <laughs> It's fantastic. Yeah. A nice dark gravy. That's pretty good too, man. You got the onion. The onion, yeah. the onion Caramelized onions strong. basically make everything taste better. 
Yeah. But your gravy is amazing. Like that's 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 on point, man. Mm. That's really good. You made the right decision. Um, do you remember which sausage is which? That is lamb and mint, and that is the Smithfield okay. 1862. So we don't know what a Smithfield 1862 is or why it's called that. But um, I'm just gonna jump yeah, in. Yeah, slice it up. Give me a piece what, too. You want a slice? Yeah. All right. And uh, I'm assuming it's meat, but they did have one sausage on there that wasn't meat. So here is Drop yours. It. Just put it in your gravy. Is good. Yep. All right. And then I'm gonna jump in as well. And I mean, it's just you know a normal looking sausage, sausage stuff. We got we got a cheers. To but what do we do? To pie and mash. All right. Good. Mm. Smithfield 1862 is a pretty good sausage. Definitely. It's got like a zingy greenery about mm. it that I don't really know. I don't know what the innards of sausages are. I couldn't, so. I couldn't begin to tell you what animal that is or anything. Beef, pork, and, Beef, pork, pork, maybe everything. and a bit alcoholic at the end of it. Mm. I don't know. Yeah, you're right. Mm. Yeah, there's a little bit of... Maybe some beer or stout. Or something. Yeah. yeah. Oh, very interesting. That was really good. All right, let's cut up the other one and do the same thing. So this is the this is the one I was most lamb excited and about. Mint. Lamb like, and mint. Like mint doesn't make. No, dude. Lamb, yeah, and lamb and mint. mint. That's exactly yeah, how you yeah. eat lamb. That's she exactly did, how to eat lamb. She didn't grow up in a lamb, yeah, yeah, yeah. lamb eating household. All right, you guys want to try this as well? Yeah. This one's a little bit darker in color. Um, I guess. What are we doing this to? Lamb. <laughs> to lamb. <laughs> to lambs. <laughs> Holy shit. That's damn good. That one's even That's better. That's opening yeah. a new door for me. Yeah, mm. I remember when you really I... have never had lamb with mint? Never. Yeah, lamb and mint jelly, And, and I remember yeah. recently I started deciding that mint ice cream was fantastic. Oh, <laughs> mint oh, chocolate chip, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I recently just got into that, so this is right up my alley for and this, now. This one has mustard in it, and you can actually see the uh, mustard bits in the gravy. So let's just jump in and see. I'm, I was hoping for a little bit of spice. It's good. It's um, it's like a, it's like a, not like a grape poupon style mustard. It's like a, with the thicker bits and stuff in it, like that. You know what I mean? <laughs> like um, something would be on like a gourmet hot dog or something. Like a good, like a good, like German style, like wiener. You know? Like that's that's what we're working with there. Yeah, Thanks right. for further describing it for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it's like a, a thick a thick gravy or a thick um, mustard. And it's good. I thought the mince was going to be more tomatoey. But it's just straight, uh, like a more almost gravy, a, a yeah. gravy, yeah. yeah, like a gravy inside with um, ground beef. Mm. Really easy, um, so there's, relaxed. Yeah. Try half of this pie with me. There's, okay. there's literally, there's literally meat inside. You already of your took pie. a bite. Did took you, a bite how that, did yeah. you feel yeah, about it? Um, yeah, very good. Really dense. And it's got a lot of yeah. meat in it. Is it chicken? Yeah, yeah chicken, chicken, bacon, leek, bit of leek. And bacon, and don't oh, no. forget that parsley. I'm gonna jump into this guy first. Okay. So this has literally got like meat inside the pie. Yeah. Right. And it's like a minced beef. Or minced. Yeah. 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 Beef. Yeah. Beef. yeah. All right. The music in here is making me happy most of the time. I really like the breading on it. Like the, it's really flaky, but it's got a pretty good flavor to it. This reminds me of something. Sorry, I, I just yeah, yeah, stabbed yeah. him. <laughs> See, I'm bad with silverware. <laughs> Seriously. Grab a little bit of this. Um, this reminds me of something that like I have had at home I got it. that I got you it. get from the <laughs> freezer section. But this is what they based the freezer section on. Oh, like a pot this. pie? Yeah, like a, like yeah. a pot pie. Yeah, yeah, but and it's not. this is what it was based it's on. It's like the difference between a frozen pizza and like a pizza from a good gourmet yeah, place. Yeah, but this yeah. is the good exactly. gourmet this place. This is the good gourmet place. Yeah. Like, America, this is where it all have, started. Meat pie isn't really that popular in the States. Um, but we do, we do have pot pies yeah. and stuff, you know? And it's mm. kind of in the same direction, but... It would be wetter inside, so this is definitely interesting. Mm. Mm. Okay, so I think you had the best gravy. Yes. Best gravy. Mm -hmm. Did you? You didn't try my mash. I didn't try. Your I didn't mash. try your mash. What flavor of mash did you have? Cole Cannon. Mm. So the traditional Irish. Mm. Got an onion in there. With the onion, it's good. And try my cabbage. Mine. Yours is the cheesy. The cheesy, yeah. Your my mash over. is killing it, dude. What about yours? You went. Cheap, my mash is very subtle. You. It, it seemed kind of like this. Yeah. Um, but can't really taste the cheese in it. Mm. And there is some cheese in it. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, you're winning on mash. Yeah, there's no joke about mm. that. That's really good. 
but I like his pie. Yeah. It's fun. Over mine. <laughs> Your sausage situation. I would have never ordered sausage. Did you like it though? Yes. Were you surprised? Yes. That mint. Oh, that mint made my day. <laughs> yeah. Well, now you're gonna have to try some lamb with some mint, man. Like yeah. Lamb chops. Every time, I, every time I see lamb from now on, I'm just gonna wonder why is there not mint being offered at all. Mint jelly. Whoa. Mm. Oh yeah, this was really awesome. So yeah, thank oh, you so much for yeah. like bringing us here. We never would have found this without cool. somebody pointing no, us in the direction. Not at all. Mm. I would have just walked by and been like, because uh, it felt to me outside a little bit like, um, uh, maybe Carnaby Street just feels like this to me that there are shops and I can't tell if they're legit. Mm. I don't know how to tell legit. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we no. really needed okay. you to help us well, with legit. Yeah, it's all legit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's all real. <laughs> We hope everyone enjoyed our final video from London. Coming next, we'll be exploring the English countryside. Make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss it. Also, check us out on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. Hey, uh, do you know what? I had to stop from, like, you know when you're in church and you just want to laugh. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> you just want to laugh. <laughs>